everyone, welcome to a bonus episode of Pokemon Violet. Where we're going to go through some last few things I want to, 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 to show you and all that. And also, I'm going to show you some of the Paradox Pokemon. The two Paradox Pokemon, and then we'll go back to the main account, see what's happening post-game. Might, might get Cerebi.net out just to check if there's any new, you know, post epilogue, not just special coaches stuff. First of all, we've got to make the, got to make a few, got to make a few, got to make a few evolutions. I did some GTS in to get these ones, so I didn't have to use any biomes for... I do have some leftover Herber. I can't transfer them over to the main account, so... I might as well see if I can get some shinies with the um, Herber Mystica. Now again, you always get some more if I do these special coaches, so... These guest account might have some use for me. Uh, we're not going to be missed. And now I'm just going to XL candy. Let's see, from a level 1, goes up 27 with an XL candy. I'm just gonna. Oh, well, I guess we're not skipping. Yeah, I'll try to make sure I get this done as quick as I can. Uh, yeah, I might as well just use the XL ones. There we go, Rampardos. And that should be 200 Pokemon. Yeah, and as you can see, Rampardos and Alolan Vulpix are Scarlet exclusives. And unless you have online raids and they popped out of Endeavor. Okay, so that is. Everyone sorted, so. So that is 200 Pokemon we've got. So let's let's meet with Perrin. Because now that we've got 200 Pokemon in the Pokedex, we can now we can now speak paradox. Hey Zeke, don't tell me. You only got yourself 200 Pokemon and Terrarium, impressive. It was hard work. Oh, look at you putting all that effort. I like to see that in a queue. You probably know more of the Pokemon and Terrarium than I do, and I got here first. I guess you only sell that hot tip. Take a look at these photos, would you? Waterfall and the, and the Iron Crown looking out from Research Station 1. I do have an idea. Hmm, I guess I could. <laughs> These photos could only be fakes. And I guess we share the Pokemon for thingies. But yes, that'll be our thingy today. Just look at all the bonus stuff we can do. I'll show you the special coach stuff through um, through my main account. So let us get inside Area Zero. Uh, something else I'll just 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 throw me Master Balls and and just 
Does that mean there will be any use for uh, anything now? Oh, we still got legendaries from. Um, yeah, we still got legendaries from. Um, uh, from oh, from Mr. Snacksworth. I wasn't able to show you that one because there was a recording error. Like, yeah, I basically had a few recording errors, like storage storage problems, which uh, messed up me. Um, Mr. Snackworth thing because I was going to show everyone Mr. Snackworth. I did. I would. To... And I forgot to set up. I forgot to set up a. Um... Okay, I, I do remember where Iron Crown is. Iron Crown should be hanging out. Uh, I was looking over at the research station. I uh, know it's hanging. Oh, there it is. Yes, this, this little. Ah, this convenient looking face. This. With the two eyes. Well, I guess we'll give it the old college try and try to capture them. Oh, wait. They're both steel, aren't they? I should be getting a steel catching thingy, shouldn't I? They should be okay. We just got to remember to, um, we just got to remember to save. Remember to reset. Well, that intimidate will help. Uh, oh, yeah, we could have tried. We could have tried quick ball, couldn't we? You know what, I should have sent over my ones to get the, the people. That that would have that would have made things a lot easier there. Oh yeah, cap oh yeah, capture thingy. Yeah, we would have to worry about the biome points anymore. Yeah, as you can tell, I did not plan. I did not plan for this um, plan for this episode. We just went we just went nuts to butts, let's just go, let's just go after these paradoxes. I've been waiting too damn long to get my, my hundred percent. You also have a war pulse, right? Okay, you will not survive a war pulse. To run away. But is it a fast Pokemon though? Ah, oh, Mazel well throw these. They might do something. Sucks to be you there. <laughs> I've got unlimited, not very effective damage. Okay, so let's, let's just throw ultra balls. I'd rather, I'd rather that you weren't confused. Rapper Ghost is definitely showing, sh um, like, definitely showing why it's the master of Area Zero there by tanking these hits. Oh, 
nicely done. That is Iron Crown Court. I suppose the instant in which you know what shiny blades cut a thing around to little pieces, let one of those known about it. Okay, so you are the gouge in fire trade. And now let's get... I think this is the waterfall in question. Don't go Jason on a listen to the rivers on your legs you used to. Yeah, somewhere around Research Area 3. You might be down here, maybe? Or... I'm trying to remember. I think you... Yeah, I think you're at the bottom of somewhere, and... I might be completely wrong, but... The Cavalier was in the same place, just check for any shinies while I'm flying. Anyway, um, uh, we may as well go through what I thought on a playthrough since this will be the since this will be the last episode. This is just bonus content that I'm going for. Ah, oh, there you are. So my hunter is right on the money. I think we'll roll up with the same team. Early intimidating. Yeah, this is a strategy. But yes, um, yeah, I guess we'll start with the epilogue and work our way back and then go forward because I didn't get to give you my proper analysis of the epilogue. Yeah, because yeah, because I was like, this thing is, if it's the epilogue, would it be just a secret cutscene or? You know, one fight, one cutscene. It was unknown what was going to happen in that one. Uh, but yeah, uh, uh, it was a it was a nice little uh, uh, fun, fun, funny ending to the to the story. got a nice Pokemon out of it. Shame I can do it with my guest account so I could enjoy my time. But it was mostly all battles anyway and... Me, 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 me take on level 100 Nimona. But yeah, I did enjoy the banter we had. Like, because that, that was some genuine laughs and jokes I was making on, on that one. And I'm the ultimate born of cynicism. Yeah, but anyway, um Yeah, I think I think Petra runs okay. Um shame they didn't add, you know, any extra lore to it. Like but there might be something if we run around and that, but I just want to deal with this one first. Then we can do the little rounds afterwards. So it's be an extra long episode because I'm going to show you a few little bonus stuff.
them, the sacred servants and damage them. Provide the same same difficulty as I did in your main save. Yeah, um, yeah, it was a good little uh, epilogue to wrap off with. Um, then we haven't got the Indigo disc to go through. Um, of course it's more better online than it is offline, but I'm surprised I was able to get 200 with only two um, bio upgrades. Sure, I may have used the power of exclusives to get um, Rampardos and, Rampardos and uh, Alone and Volpix, but um, the, the Owl Creamy wasn't working because of the Joy-Con Drift. And could have probably got Electivire and um, Magmortar from the terror battles if they popped up on that front. But yes, I, I did grow to enjoy Carmine Kieran. And as you can tell from the funny voice, we never Carmine. Yeah, that actually turned out to be they would they they were they they they, they, they were worthy to, they they were the moon Arvid and Penny worthy to be And you can really tell that they're fleshing out their characters a lot more in newer games, which you'd expect then, you know, the GBA stuff and that, which And you know it, Hopefully it continues on the up and up because you know there's more character development in the rivals, there's more arcs they go through. Yeah, so And of course, I know we didn't get to see Kevin in um, in the um, in the in, in the prologue and that. I, like, I, I just I just enjoyed the lore that I was building. And yes, Carmine Three Stooges' voice is the head cannon. Okay, better check this Pokedex. Because I did get a few extras. Ooh, a gold bottle cap. Hmm, that might be interesting to. Hmm, eight more Pokemon. Hmm. Yeah, so, yeah, so that'd be just one bio upgrade that would. Hmm, interesting. I might do that off screen. But anyway, we'll continue more about my experiences and my, my, my review of the whole thing. We're just gonna fly to. But that is my Iron Crown Iron Boulders Court for a GTS. CJK, that Pokemon, it's not from the picture. It's a real life iron boulder. This thing's built. It says it charges its horns with energy, using them to plow through everything in its path. Without watching this thing will be a fearsome threat to face. I hope you just snap a couple of photos there. Wouldn't be funny if it was like the thing, because they're robots. Um, if it was like, like the, that, that Simpsons episode where they were taking photos of the robots. 
the, the itch and scratch your own ones. Rumour has it that this fellow could buy off beams from its horns that will cut through anything at all. If it were true, then this thing would be a fearsome threat to fear. Hmm, I wonder if I do get the Paradox ones, she mentions anything about them ones. Couldn't keep my mind off those babies, you saved me. I don't know any more or anything, but I don't think the mystery of the rest is a prize. Sports ball. Special Pokeball that's used during the bug catching hunts in the Jutta Legion. Bottle cap, so I might. I think we'll. I think. I think it'll be time to move on to the main save. So I'm just going to save here. Yeah, because any candies I can do off camera, but I'll actually show you a quick a bit of snack work here. It'll be quite it'll be quite quicker to do that with snack work in this bit because I mean I still think we've got plenty of snack worth stuff I have to unlock. Oh you better check to save because otherwise I don't want to be catching iron boulders and iron crown again. We've got to make sure we save. Okay that, that's a save. I'm also going to quickly change the controller setup. Uh, there we go. Button mapping. Load the load the preset, which gets rid of snapshots. Joy-Con drift, ladies and gentlemen. Joy-Con drift. Anyway, main save away. Oh yeah, I was meant to look if there was any bonus stuff. Yeah, I got too busy trying to capture iron boulders and that, but... See if there's any other interesting things we can explore. May as well may as well make this the extra long episode to to show you all the extra details we haven't done. speak to um, um, Clavel first, but oh, outbreak of Miss Magnuses. We need some quite good outbreaks. Didn't think there was a, a special shiny thing happening or a special capturing thing. There's the Blazer King range. Oh yeah, we should probably speak, yeah, we should probably speak to Nimona, Penny and Arvin in the See if they got anything for us. Oh, hey, Dave, what's up? Hello there, Professor Dave. I'm oh, 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 classroom eagle. Pop. Oh, hey, hey, 
我们往上。Oh, they got more stuff. Mochi, mochi, match. Don't really remember much that night, but it's still fun to say. Oh, God. She's got her own battle cry now. Hmm, there doesn't seem to be any extra stuff. Our trip to Kitakai was the best. I got to go to you with all my buds. Thanks for inviting us along. No problem, Arvin. Oh, yeah, yeah sorry, my boss did hello as well. Bit of a random aggressive roar there. I'm just having a look at Nimona's battle team from um apparently she has the Dusk Noir Dusk Noir if she had Skeledurge as a starter. The Bombi if she had Quaquavel and my my Lotic if Murray Alcarada. No, that's not bad. Has a lot of outdoor time. Gotta hold up indoors for a bit to balance out. Spoke like a true chap, Penny. Words of wisdom there. So it's saying Lee Cloth stuff, which I was going to go through anyway. Uh, let's see Director's Office. Hmm, Trainer customizations. I guess they have something to do with the special coaches. I think it's all special coach stuff, I think. Conceal mask for a lot of what were, were good stuff, as I mentioned. Like, you know, the characters were good. I think if you're having fun voicing a character and just, you know, taking, like, doing jokes with them, I think it makes them all good. It's, it's, it, it, like, it, like, it's, like, it's like the burger with strength. It, it's, like, it's like the burger with strength, if not cool. Oh, you know what we should check if if there's any stuff in the lighthouse. Because are they just gonna have us see Professor Choro without Arvin coming to Kitakami and that and There's the crystal. There's the, the, the there's the Trapagos crystal. That's Trapagos's body there. Yeah, I'm just going through every bit of detail that we can find, really. If not, then we'll just we'll just Blueberry Academy. Gonna quickly fly to my gaff in it. Uh, 
Thank you. Okay, so we'll quickly head off to Kitakami, see if there's anything happening there. I still haven't yet found the ogres yet. I might as well just really search them. I mean, we're not sponsored by Cerebi.net, but if you want a sponsor, Cerebi, I am your guy. I've been looking at all your Pokemon stuff since Gen 4, I want to say. Gen, Gen 4. Nearly 20 years. Okay, so the crystal pool. where Trafagos was. You, you'd think Trafagos would use its powers to um, do all that stuff again for us. But no, nope, I guess it was a long time thing. Okay, so we'll just quickly go check. Actually, we'll check if there's anything in Loyalty Plaza. The sword might do a bit of like law dropping for us. I can confirm that you did not. Still, I can't believe that we that we're going to the end of, of, of Violet in general. Though that's the thing, because I've done the Let's Play of it, and I ah Peachy. Any new stuff for us? Say these were. I think I think story-wise, these are better than the um, than the Sword and Shield one. Uh, when it comes to area, I want to say I want to say exploration-wise, Sword and Shield kind of has it, but. I think the epilogue make I think because there's, I think I just feel like there's more stuff in um in this game than in, in this DLC than there was a sword and shield, which is why I feel like the DLC in this was better. But let me let me know in that. What what, what you think. I think it's because more character and I think that's what it tops over the So yeah, I get yeah, I'd say yeah, I'd say the DLC was an improvement. But it doesn't mean we should take any way thing away. Um, the DLC for Sword and Shield was still good. But I'm just I'm sure since this is the second DLC, they'd be you know they'd be competing against each other, which is odd, because I didn't see a lot of people competing between You know, between uh, yeah, this is essentially second time Pokemon's had DLC, well, main story wise, because they get Pokemon to on that DLC. But but anyway, Blueberry Academy is next.
Okay, well, I'm going to show you Mr. Snack's worth. And these group quests he's saying are for the online stuff. That's how you're able to get mostly all of all of the Pokemon. Basically, he'll give you a treat here, and he'll give you a little story of how he hung out with them and they stay in the same place. But what's his secret though to attracting all the legendaries? So I saw my own size near a town I passed through in Paldea. Town was where a lot of hard working folk live, time to get their hands dirty, kind of a nice height to look on their hard working carpenter landscape. That's right. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I've got anything cool with him, but. Oh, Kriugan. Uh, there's a Kriugan retreat. Fight pretty rare, that one. Not your one of the mill Pokemon. I wonder if Snackworth's based on a, a developer or a developer's dad or not. See, I was from a snowy mountain where a terrible storm blew in. I had no choice but to hunker down in a cave underground. I didn't even know the place was a cave, it was four soaring heights and wide passage. The bloody as any labyrinth too. And the grand time explored the nooks and crannies with a sheet of ice suddenly had been moved. Rubbed by eyes, not believing it was once there was no ice sheet, but was breathing right in front of me. Yeah, so we just basically run up to find legendaries and that. Kieran's dorm room's been unlocked, so and it's just nearly just the same as a lot of detailed notes of strengths and weaknesses. Oh my god, he's done the full Charlie Day. This is all for me. Oh, the hood's gone. The bedding design has an ancient lettering on it. Carbon full of candy wrappers. Was all of this for me? <laughs> well, that wall, that wall isn't big enough. There's not enough writing on that. For this, they added more teacher characters in this one. Okay, so let's chat to a few, see if they've got anything for us. Yeah, because you speak to them a few times, you get to trade Pokemon with them. Don't know what I am going to do first. How many BB? Oh, well, that's plenty of BBQ points. I guess we can make a. Uh, Contribution. Uh, uh, yeah, let's slowly decorate. Let's just decorate. This is the elegant one. Let's go back to normal, some natural. Let's go monochrome this time. little room. So I'm going to show you the printer. Basically need as many tiers as we can. And the more it's upgraded, cheaper to BP. Oh no, that's a lot of Duraludon challenge. But what would it auto-select with? 
Is it still the Kleppers? Oh, Trapinch. Oh, that's a lot of Trapinch shells. Oh yeah, we'll do them. Yeah, so I'm going to upgrade a few. And this is where you can get lucky eggs and amulet coins if you haven't got them already. That's, that's how they get those amulet coins for me. so much of these Trapin shells because I was trying to you know quotation marks shiny capture or shiny hunt. Shy Hunt was really good here because they can because they can be able to get all of this. Is that the Master Ball? Have we got the Master Ball? Oh, Heavy Ball. Gonna check if we're allowed to upgrade it. Or do we have to do a lot more? Okay, that's never mind, that's all good. Uh, yep, so let, 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 let's chat to Crispin and um, Carmine. Hey, Crispin, you're in the same class as Kiki, right? Ah, that's right, I'm even appearing in all your bonus episodes as well, see? Yep, same peep in class. How's Kiki doing, since you know he came back? We study, we talk, we have battles, it's pretty normal, I guess. Oh yeah, nobody's picking on anything or anything, right? Carmine, you underestimate his powers. He could probably slaughter with his Pokemon. Well, I mean, some kids are scared of him because how he was. But he's much more approachable, right? It's all good. I like Kieran how he is. You know, you're a nice guy, Chris, but even you're kind of a dent sometimes. Did you mean you throw in that diss? Oh, of course I did. <laughs> You can say hi on your own, finally, in some manners, huh? Any keys back in school, which means I am too. Do any of you see me better come say hi within two seconds flat, no day dying? Do I have to? You know what? Let's, let's banter with Carmine. Hehehe, <laughs> that sour look you get is the best, I love it. We'll be back in school, though. I was in Kiss Carmine long enough to feel crowded here. You know how mostly town, there's just nothing there, I mean, that's what I like about it, but still. You know what, I think we should battle Carmine. I feel like that'll be fun. And then we'll have a look into sending the coach over and then have a battle there with them. 
I don't forget we get the cool theme. Yeah, I, yeah, oddly enough, I, I said when this is the High Night OST we got, this theme's just that good. Yeah, we, we couldn't end. We couldn't end the bonus episode of having a fight with Carmen. I'm gonna miss you too and all, chat. But anyway, Animal Crackers still on the line. If you want to, to take part in the Animal, the Animal Crackers public domain, I'm gonna see if I can drag Leaky along. Maybe, maybe. I see if Amaris might be interested as well. You see. I don't mind a little script reading. I feel like I'm part of the CJK family now, you see. Is a black and white free. I, like, like, as I mentioned before, in a kind of like um, teal mask, but I think that's the best approach. Like, don't do a legend, don't do a remake. Because you essentially got the story there, basically. You know, this is what happened after, you know, when Blueberry Academy brought terrestrialization. It's like, oh, here's terrestrialization. All the Terra trainers using their new skills to overpower the champions in Unova and you know terrestrialization becomes a new thing like the new like you know the, the new mechanic you know a mechanic they bought from Paldea Unova region, and you know, the clock can be t t Team Plasma giving it one more go. Like, yeah, sure, I think the, t the, t the Team Plasma plot should be more along the lines of um, you trying to use their terror powers to grab pressure around Zekron for you again. Or better yet, they're doing that bad not having Gexes on the team. You know, kind of like, you know, like the Rocket Tower takeover? And then after you do all that stuff, you get a reward. You know, something simple as laid back as, but focus more on how terrestrializations improve the trainers. Like, it doesn't have to be all about the villains. It can just be a simple. You know, it can be just be a simple. You know, we're putting more emphasis on the trainers now. You've still got Team Plasma, but. You know, they, they've got that kind of Johto wash, like, like Team Rocket had. that never got to experience rationalization. You know, they, you know, that might be a thing is like, oh, we don't want to keep up with these times, you know. 
terrestrialization is cheating, you know, someone might say that, and, you know, Drayton and Dryden, was it? What, was that the name of the trainer? You know, him, him saying to Iris and Dryden that, you know, you like, give it a try, give it a try. Like, you know, my thing of it is Pokemon Terror Black or Pokemon Black 3 Terror White 3 Terror. That'll probably be the name I give it. Because the thing, the, thing, the thing I'm like, you know, you know, a bit concerned about is like, I, I, will they be able to squeeze new towns or cities? You know, would they be able to add Blueberry Academy in as part of an extra bonus area? You know, make um, you know, make you know, have a Western Unova because we had the Eastern Unova in Black and White too, where we had the you know our hometown uh, Burbank City. Ah, oh, better ones. Time to bring him out. Quite a strong attack. It will give Petra at the last move here. I think I won here in spirit anyway. Joke glasses, sinnets chime. Thanks, come on. <laughs> Easy answer, just way cooler. <laughs> okay, let's hire a special coach and I'll wrap up the entire playthrough. Prizes, two trains. I'm going to all the trains apart from Tulip. Have I done all the teachers yet? Uh, oh, apart from Jack and Flavau. Yeah, I've still got plenty of stuff to do there with the coaches. Uh, I'm just going to. Yeah, let's, let's invite Nimona. I'm here to cause chaos. It's time to bring in Fight Club. I have doomed Blueberry Academy. <laughs> I just challenged a receptionist to battle. can get one more on team. Oh, Carmine and Nimona are talking. We should better see what they say. Hey, Nimona, how'd you get so strong? Oh, you call me strong? Thanks, Carmine. What? No, I wasn't complimenting you. I was asking you a question. What's your secret? My secret, huh? My secret? I guess working really hard and training my Pokemon really hard. Oh, come on. I already do that. Yeah. 
Sheesh. All I want to do is get really strong and really fast and surprise Callum. Because it's not that easy. Oh, I did some, didn't you? I didn't why didn't you and I do some training together. Sure, but you're way too strong, so you know. Say no more, exact max power move, the gloves are coming off. That's not what I'm asking at all. That's right, come on, you shall fear me. <laughs> it's wild how different Blueberry Academy is from our school back home, huh? Hmm, heck, who knows, maybe Nimona could be his champion in the... It, it, you know, um, maybe. But again, I think I just want to do more of Carmine's voice, really. I'm the champ now. I even beat my brother, see? I beat Iris. I beat... If I knew Team Plasma were back, I would have whooped them too. I sat quickly inside the terrain. I can't believe it's all underwater. It all looks like regular above water. Heavy school put a super heavy focus on Pokemon battling too. That means I can battle to my heart, so keep content here, right? <laughs> Within reason. <laughs> These reasons are strong. I must fight them. And as soon as I take care of what you call me for, I've gone about every student here. I'm really glad you invited me. Thank you so much. Yep, we shall battle soon. But anyway, everyone, thank you for joining me in Pokemon Violet. Um, <laughs> I hope you enjoyed every single bit. And if you and if you want more Pokemon stuff in the future, like future games and that, let let me know and join us in the next playthrough, wherever that may be. Could be Kirby Month, could be if you want any bonus special coach stuff, I'm all here for that as well. But thank you for joining me and my continuous adventures with Pokemon series. A, a, a good successful another main game series got got some new favorite pokemon got some new favorite characters and thank you all for joining as well so farewell and cheerios and it is time to close the Pokeball, close the Pokedex for the time being. But farewell and cheerios, and remember, you've still got to catch them all and be the best like no one ever was.